In a bid to bring a tough law to tackle crimes against women, the union cabinet on Thursday cleared a bill providing for stringent punishment for rape, acid attacks, stalking and voyeurism. Special provisions have been made in the bill to ensure stern punishment for sexual offences against women. The cabinet accepted all the suggestions made by the group of ministers on anti-rape laws headed by Finance Minister P. Chidambaram. The cabinet deliberated upon the recommendations of the group of ministers with respect to the suggestions made regarding the criminal law amendment bill. The cabinet, after discussing the recommendations, has in its wisdom approved the bill as recommended by the group of ministers. According to the bill, rape has been defined based on the principle that is a gender-specific crime. The bill is being made women-centric, which means only men will be charged. The bill provides for death sentence if the rape victim dies or is left in a persistent vegetative state. The maximum punishment for rape in the bill would be life imprisonment. The bill has a provision of lowering the age of consent for sex from 18 to 16 years, which was earlier opposed by Women and Child Development Ministry. Stalking and voyeurism have been defined as criminal offences in the bill. Sustained stalking will be a non billable offence. As of now, the bill has been cleared by the cabinet, but the path is still not smooth for it. After the bill finally comes into being, it will replace an ordinance related to women's security implemented last month. This is the reason that the bill needs to get passed in the first part of the budget session, which is concluding on 22nd March. Main opposition party BJP has assured full support to the government but has not fully cleared its stand. Whereas government's ally Samajwadi party has objections with some provisions of the bill. We have been waiting for this uh, cabinet approval because ordinance has come and the bill has to come to convert the ordinance into a legislation. We have been waiting for it and... Um, uh, uh, we, let's see what it is. The, it will be brought before the house and then we will speak about it. The bill passed by the Kendri Sarkar. I agree with something I agree with something. If someone has raped with a child and has been raped with a child, then the people who have raped with a child and have been raped with a child should be raped with a child. And in any way, if someone has been raped with a child and has been raped with a child, और रेप भी किया जाए ऐसे हालात में भी उसको सजाए मौत या आजीवन कारावास होना चाहिए जो तीसरी बात बिल में रखी गई है कि यदि कोई लड़का घूरता है और लड़की वैसे ही शिकायत कर देती है तो गैर जमानती वारंट इसमें थोड़ा शिथिलता देना चाहिए क्योंकि आजकल कुछ ऐसा भी देखा जाता है कि लोगों को गलत ढंग से साजिशन फंसाने का भी काम किया जाता है the government now plans to introduce and get the bill passed in parliament next week. In this regard, an all-party meet has also been called to evolve a consensus on the bill. With Bureau inputs, Rishi Kumar and Sudhakar Das's report, DD News.